What advice would you give to women in their 20s? I would say try and live them in real life. Mm. So less online. Stop looking at your screen and look at your friend. Yeah. And I would say if you're with a friend, turn your phone off. Yeah. So that you're with that person for that moment. And and be yourself. I don't have a phone. Nobody you believes that. Got, I don't you don't have, have a phone. phone. A friend. I've got, a, I've got one friend. or two friends, but yes. no phone. All right. And how do you contact do them? By, by letter? No, by pigeon. By pigeon, of course. <laughs> no, obviously. But actually, the truth is, it's having grown up without a phone, I don't need it. So I don't use it. And it means oh. that nobody can keep on yapping and ringing and saying stuff. Mm. You just don't have it. You have your own head. That's where you think things up. Was there ever a character from Ab Fab that you didn't create that you always wanted to create? Oh, there was <laughs> one of the... Ruby did Mrs. Truman Capote. She was, yeah, there was a little American woman little Jewish American woman called mm. Mrs. Truman Capote that Ruby created that yeah. I wanted always to have in Ab Fab. And I promised her actually probably that she could be in the film as Mrs. Truman Capote, but it never happened. <laughs> <laughs> but it was just, she dresses like Truman Capote and she's like this and she's absolutely as racist and as horrible as possible. And it's like this evil little person that moves about. But we've never actually found the right place for her, but she's very, very funny. Are Patsy and Eddie feminists? Not really. I don't think they're feminists, except that I think Eddie probably thinks she's a feminist because... Um, it's trendy. Because it's trendy. And, and she wants to be means, politically everything that everyone is, thinks is cool. She yeah. wants to be cool. So she would have invented... She wouldn't quite know what it meant, but she would definitely want to be it. What can Patsy and Eddie teach us about growing old disgracefully? Do it. Just do it. I mean, look at the film. Look what they do. They don't care. They get a 13-year-old to drive mm -hmm. their car. They run away from the police. They drink far too much. Mm. They turn into the dresses men and dupe people. I mean, Stop, yes. it's I, not I really think a very good lesson to, to, to teach people, is it? Not care what the world thinks so much, you know. That's true. You've got limited time left. And stick Go together. Go for it. Yeah. <laughs>